still standing there. Back with another episode and trying to find Washington. Lawrence Washington, not George. There, over there somewhere. Brother, are you sure you shouldn't be in bed? I am fine, George. Be a good host for my sake. Go to the wine cellar and get something special for our guests. I will. Gentlemen? Hey, George. I assume we don't kill him. <coughs> my brother is a bright spot in a troubled land. If I may make one request before I depart this life, please leave him in peace. He should have nothing to do with the troubles of the Templar cause. We all respect that sentiment, sir. You have my thanks, gentlemen. Master Smith, are you ready to leave on your voyage? Aye, sir. I shall return with answers. Master Wardrop, are you likewise engaged with the manuscript? Yes, sir. We will soon know its meaning. Then I bid you take your leave. <laughs> Washington can barely stand on his own two feet. Better be right about him, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying Kill man. Washington while blended. Make enemies berserk with air rifle. And don't get detected. Berserk, huh? This ought to be a good fight. Kill the other, please. Target to go berserk. Oh no, someone's shooting. I wonder if I can make Washington go berserk and get them to kill him. Ooh. Oh, don't run. He's running, isn't he? <laughs> Got the guards to kill him. It's never too late to ruin Templar plans, Master Washington. <coughs> but my plans are already in motion. Even leading you here <coughs> has 
has given my allies time to escape. <coughs> Thank you for making my end a quick one. And thank you for revealing your master plan, you scheming snake. Okay, smoke bombs, sure. Yes, I did get the kill him while blended. Reached the Morgan, but there's like no uh, guards left. God damn it. Better hurry. Liam, I hope you brought the ship around. Oh, Morgan's taking damage. Okay. Is that a go. shit mortar? That's not sported! Yeah. I didn't realize the Morgan was taking damage. Okay. I'm coming for you, buddy. Lawrence Washington is dead. He looked disappointed. In the sickly way that man looked, he would have been dead in a month anyway. And two other Templars got away. They're looking into the manuscript and box. Did they have the artifacts? I don't know. Perhaps. I can't be sure. Then you did what was right by the Brotherhood. We'll find the object later. Cheer up, Shane. It's a rare day we could sow such chaos among the Templars. Perhaps. But to hear Washington speak, it didn't sound like they'd be too put out by the loss. Well, that's what he'd want you to think. The memory appears to be fragmented. How much time has passed? A few months, I think. That virus is cutting off our access to complete memories. The readable, but messy. The Seven Years' War will soon break out in the colonies. Focus on assassin interference. We'll do our best. Won't we, numbskull? Spread. It's so grim about the homestead now that Miss Abigail and little Connor have passed. Aye. I've seen Achilles crying. Why shouldn't he? It's just that, he doesn't look sad. He looks furious. It's unsettling. He's struggling with the loss. I know, but it's been months. And we've done little but search for this blasted manuscript and box. Sir has a lead on the box. We 
Healy said whoever had the artifacts could access sites of great power. What does he mean? I'm not sure I understand it myself, Shane. I had a long talk with Adam Wally about that. He believes the box can be activated to well, project words or images. It's like a magic lantern. What do you mean? The magic lantern shows Father Connolly put on in the church basement. The box had a candle in it, I think. He put these little glass plates in front. Then we'd see the images projected on the wall, like cathedrals in Rome, bright and near as big as life. Ah, yeah. I suppose it is. Except that it interprets the strange language of the manuscript, too. If the plate were of a banner in Latin, we'd see it in English. How is that possible? Who knows? I fear we might never truly understand how any of the pieces of Eden work. Where in the world has the most beautiful girls? I suppose it depends on your vision of beauty. A damsel from Corfu and one from Oslo are as different as chalk and cheese, but both could be lovely. You see, opinions like that give a man a reputation for wisdom. Yeah, thank you. I would have just said Havana. The girls there have lusty buttocks and bosoms and feel no shame in putting them on display. But Alrighty, then. that's no slight against our lasses from home. I suppose. I think Galway has the nicest ones. Fair and modest. Always willing to spot you a penny for an ale. You don't say. And then there's the maids I met in Lisbon. Destined for the convent they were. Dark-eyed and kindly dispositioned. If only I'd spoke Portuguese. Ooh, man of war. Not I'm that not we spent much of our nights those. talking. Opinions like that give a man an entirely different reputation.
Ah, yes. A long way to kill the captain, to shoot the flag. Lost some crew, but not too much, and this should replenish it. Plus all the loots. Even more monies! I'll take it. Thank you, Portuguese man of war, or whoever you were, for uh, helping in this endeavor. We're almost there, Captain. Le Chasseur will be expecting us. I'm Chevalier. Ah, it's a small price to pay for a lead in the precursor box. Do 
some upgrades real quick. See if I can get some more stuff. Cannons are always better to have more of. So this was the Morgan, I think what they, the black flag was the Jackdaw, if I recall correctly. She would run off. Come on. Come to me. Pourquoi est-on venu ici Il n'y a que des bêtes sur la Les animaux, on peut les traquer.
I haven't done any hunting in a while to um, upgrade my armor. <laughs> Should look into that too. over at the time and we're gonna call this episode here next time we'll uh I'll try to go up there do the sink and start this next section thank you for watching if you enjoyed please leave a like bye